Hello guys and welcome back, this is Player and today I am going to show you a motion de detector for um, shifting or jumping. So if you stand right in the device, um, nothing pops up, but if you shift, it will say 0 and if you jump it will say 1, of course, that's just um, tripwire working there. And uh, so I watched the video of Lock Dossip and uh, he showcased that in 1.9 there has been a change that um, you can actually detect player player motion using uh, I mean shifting um, with different hitboxes so if you walk into the device game nothing happens but if I press shift um, this um, tripwire actually cannot detect me standing inside and um, um, the entity actually I mean the entity of the player actually sh shrink and um, went into these two blocks instead of the third one so um, when I shift it will create a pulse here with a uh, end gate something like that and uh, give me a zero so quite simple and when I jump it will trigger the um, third trip wire and then trigger this one saying one and uh, so I think that's all there is to it and I think that's only useful for um, creatives, uh, I mean like custom maps creating or something like that of course in, in um, survival is actually a little bit hard to wire them up and a little bit hard to actually bind them into uses like um, elevators because you can put pistons inside put wires or so on. So um, yeah. So when you press shift, you get the zero, and when you press, you get one. So you can actually do some coding, with, like something like this, and uh, kind of stuff. So it's a little bit useful for um, maybe you, maybe some combination locks or something like that, but um, not really useful in survival. So I'm just showcasing. Um, you can actually use such a thing to um, detect the player motion of shifting or jumping. So let's crack into um, how to build this thing. So as you can see it's really simple. First thing you need is to um, um, place a block where you want to stand, I mean where the device detects where you are doing the motion and then you want to place four snow layer and for four snow layer you probably if you are familiar with minecraft you know the four snow layer actually um, looks the same with the half slab here you can actually there see there is eight pixels right there but when you stand on it you can see the difference in height um, we are a little bit lower than uh, the half slab when we are in the snow block i mean snow layer four snow layer so it's only 375 and here is um, 500 and some, some like that so um, the first thing you need to know you cannot use half less layer you have to use snow layer so there's four um, this snow layer of four and then uh, the next thing you need to do is to put down down string one two three and four if you can see what I did there and then you need to put down tripwire hooks but before that you need to put in blocks so you need three like this going on and then another three blocks here and last one here tripwire hook so um, the next thing you want to do is to place down a stick piston, we will be placing here, and then not a stick piston, but a resting block, and then um, a resting here, and another resting here, and uh, really that's, um, and then you just put a block here and put a resting here. You need to put a torch here to invert the signal and then actually I did something wrong here, I shouldn't put the resting here, it should be here. 
and then you just put another block here and uh, now the listening torch here so now the shifting de detection thing is already finished when you shift this will turn on and when you unshift it, it will turn off and yeah so the shifting has worked and actually that's all for for the actual detecting thing already so if you want to extract the signal you just want to take the signal from here and also here which you see uh, maybe 3 and 2 and then you just um, walk right into the device and then when you press shift you see 2 and you press jump you see 3 shift jump shift jump shift shift jump so yeah so it is actually very simple and uh, well, this is just a showcase, showcase video for um, motion detector thing and uh, not really very useful in survival as I just mentioned but um, I think we can maybe use that in your custom maps or something like that so um, I think that's all I've got time for today and I hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you guys have any comments or how to improve this to bind it with other devices like uh, elevators around there and things like that um, I would much appreciate and please leave a comment if you have such opinions so yeah I think that's all for this video and I'll see you guys next time bye bye